Hey guys, Scott Ellis coming at you again from CES 2015, and I'm here to show you how to get the big screen experience without the usual big screen price. Welcome to Geek Beat. All right, we're here at the Elite Screens booth, and you guys might already know Elite Screens from the screen that we hung up and have done several vlogs and posts and shown things on at the Geek House. Well, they're here at CES, and I have Dave Rogers here to talk to me a little bit about what's new with Elite, including this amazingly bright screen off to my left that is, I, I can't believe how bright this thing is because we're standing here and there's a lot of light and usually with a projection screen you're not going to get this so tell me what's going on this is cool. Uh, sure will. Well Scott first of all thanks for the all the screens in the past glad it's working out for you and this is the next step that we're taking as far as projection screen technology and hopefully we can grace the halls of your fine establishment with it. But We'd love to have one of these in the Geek House by the way you can send one anytime we'll find a place for it. <laughs> Anyhow so uh, what we worked on is a ambient light rejecting technology. And the ambient light rejecting technology means just that. With the lights on in the room, you're still gonna get the same television brightness on your screen. This has been kind of the holy grail of projection screen technology, and it has been available for quite some time if you had the money for it. What we did is we made it available to the average consumer and that's what's so revolutionary about it. We, we also took a few little liberties to kind of enhance the appeal. And you see here, this is our, um, this is an ambient light rejecting material that we have. It's our uh, Syngray 5D. It essentially absorbs the indirect light while amplifying the directly projected light. Uh, essentially happens at that point is what you see right here. You've got a nice clear picture, great contrast, great color, and with the lights on or off, you're gonna achieve that same result. Also, uh, you notice it's an edge-free design here. Now the edge-free design is essentially to give you that extra kind of, I guess, ambiance for the room. You can really mix this with any kind of decor, you're not going to clash. It's a straight footprint, you project on it, you have this giant flat panel image. And of course, when uh, the show is on or off, you have this fantastic mood lighting, 16 color, 4 mode mood lighting that essentially kind of, for lack of a better word, pimps your room. Okay, so. The screen that we're looking at here that we're seeing Avatar on, what size is the screen to give people a sense of perspective? This is a 120 inch screen. Now if you think about how much that would cost if you were hitting it with a flat panel, let's say, well you need a structural engineer to put it in, it's going to be exorbitantly expensive, whereas something like this has an MSRP around the $1,300 range. Couple that with a projector, you're good to go, and you're gonna have many, many years of enjoyment with that product. Okay, so for $1,300, now that's just the screen, mind you, that doesn't include your projector, but that's, you can get a nice big picture, it's very bright, exactly. and again, I'm, I'm just amazed at how bright it is with all of the ambient light we have here. That looks amazing, so this is good stuff. All right, thank you very much, I appreciate it. Guys, again, if you're looking for a big screen experience, but you don't want that big screen price, go out and take a look at Elite Screens. How can, uh, how can people find out more about these? Where should they go? www.elitescreens.com. There you go. And in the meantime, we're going to go out and find more great stuff to bring to you from CES 2015. See you soon.